हेलो गाइस एंड वेलकम बैट एट मास्टर कैम मिल्टन ट्यूटोरियल टूल पाथ मास्टर कैम इन दिस सीरीज वी विल स्टडी अबाउट द वेरियस टाइप ऑफ मिल्टन ट्यूटोरियल टूल पाथ इन दिस ट्यूटोरियल सीरीज वी विल डिटेल अबाउट द थ्री टू फोर कंपोनेंट्स ऑफ मास्टर कैम मिल्टन ट्यूटोरियल बाय द हेल्प ऑफ सी एक्सेस ऑपरेशन इन दिस वीडियो वी विल प्रिपेयर मॉडल फॉर दैट वन कंपोनेंट विच इज on the so as you can see on the display when in the component so for this component there are various type of operations we are already prepared I'll explain you about that how we can prepare that one model so first let me introduce with the drawing that what is the drawing say and what is in the detail of the drawing so that one is the drawing for that one part so in this drawing there is a simple and easy drawing the largest diameter for that one part is 50 mm and the total length is 75 mm in this drawing there are one two steps and the last one is the largest diameter on these steps the second on the first step there is a simple diameter which is diameter 25 mm and on the second one step there is a six side hexagon on the six side of hexagon there is a one drill which coordinate are also detail in the drawing and then third one the third one part which is shown on the that one area which diameter is 25 mm and that one have the six side which radius is also here 25 mm a type of radius on these the outer work side area the all these parts there is a radius and the radius value is r3 so let me prepare that one model you can watch this video and easily learn how we can prepare that one model so let me open the master cam so i have to just open a new file new and don't save drawing is also available in the description and the model is also available in the description you can download both of these then i just press the right side and now i have to prepare that one portion the right side visualization and that one area so for creating that one area i choose the radius of that one part is r 18.5 mm and the total side is 6 I have to choose rectangle side portion and choose polygon. Create a polygon and then input the radius value eighteen point five, and the total sides are six. If we consider or want to check that one drawing properly, there is a radius and that radius value is from the corner side area. So I select corner. and then i have to just press okay the point of that one area is the minus 12 mm so i have to just select that one area going to transform translate and input that one select that one back side and the minus 12.0 enter enter and move that one component okay right click clear color and top view So as you can see that one area is I am make that one side that distance is 12 mm. Again I have to press top and then right side area. Again I have to choose wireframe for creating the second one entity which Z is 25 mm. So right side area and I have to select again rectangle portion and polygon. The total side of that one part is eighth side. So I have to select eight side. Radius of that one component is twenty five mm as per drawing, and again it is basis on the corner portion. But when we are going to detail study about the drawing, that one portion of that area is the here. That one portion and that one is area is flat. So I have to choose the drawing and rotate that one component. so what is the exact angle 
for the finding exact angle i have to press 45.0 divided by 2 because the total side is 8 side and press ok for creating that radius of that one portion again i have to select wireframe arc entities the, radi the total radius value as per the drawing 25 mm i make entity that one look first point second point i have to select that one entity and press ok then again i have to rotate that one entity from the each side for the rotating i have to go transform rotate select entity and selection the number of total rotation 7 and the angle 360 divided by 8 I have to input 7 number because one entity is already we have so that one area the all entities are prepared I remove the extra and unwanted entities so that trim then as per drawing we just go for the preparing the radius value which is the out here r3 mm we have to go for the fluid chain select chain ok and the input the radius value which is the radius value is 3.0 mm and ok again we have to prepare that one circle of that one area for the preparing circle select circle and the diameter of that one circle is 3 mm and i have to just lock that one so press here 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 and the last one entity ok you can also prepare all these circle by the help of bolt circle or by the help of rotating now i just prepared that one area and now I have to translate that one area for translating that area just select go for the transform translate select that one area and selection and again the total length is 25 and the value is in minus 25.0 I just move that one entity then preparing for the final part and the in inner portion the inner portion radius is 25 mm so again i have to prepare there is a one cylindrical portion so circle and the radius i have to input 25 mm diameter okay okay so now i will so first i have to prepare the cylinder for preparing cylinder i have to just select solid extrude after pressing the extrude i have to select the entity which i want to extrude select that one entity okay the portion is going that one way i have to change direction and the total length is 75 mm and then okay again i have to select that one entity okay i now i press add boss and the total length is we can selecting from this one portion okay so automatically the total length from here to here creating then press ok now i have to select that one entity and ok the total length is 12 mm and ok so all our dimension we are prepared as per the drawing now we have to prepare the holes for all these circles select select all holes direction should be in the same direction select 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 and ok now select at the cut entity and the input throw all ok so as you can see the all parts are ok and we are preparing that one portion all holes now there is a one final entity we, which we have to prepare on that one portion that is the face so we go for the top 
and we will have to prepare one circle and the coordinates are also given so we have to just go for wireframe select that one entity that one entity that one entity that one entity and now circle and the value of the circle is 5 mm as per drawing and press ok 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 delete all these entity now we have to go to solid extrude ok ok throw all ok so as per drawing and as per model we are preparing the whole part for that one it is a easy and a simple method that you can also prepare that kind of model